All right, we are here at the Escalante Visitor Center. So I just made out of the bathroom. This is what it looks like behind. I'm gonna go check in, moderate risk of fires, and then we're gonna get started on our backpacking trip. Stay tuned. All right, we are all suited up. We're here at the destination. It's a little rainy. We should be die off in about an hour. But first little bit, we'll be in the rain. This is uh, this is the back looks like pretty sick. Here we go. Yeah. Rain has stopped. We're in these really cool kind of low shrubs right across the river. And we're guessing which parts of our body are going to be the most sore. I'm going with shoulders. Seth, what's going to be the, your sorest part? My legs. Seth's going with his legs. Keep you updated. First, first river we got across right here. Seth's approach to danger. Picking up a sheet rock. Huh? Thank you, That's the toilet paper. We're climbing up the sheet rock. Woo, it's brutal. We're about two and a half miles in, start to sprinkle again. We're gonna start de descending. But that uphill was brutal. Oh yeah. What'd you think of it, Seth? That was terrible. <laughs> Absolutely horrible. <laughs> it was a good push, but man, this is crazy. That's that first peak on the map, right? Yeah. yeah. Half of the worst part down. <laughs> oh. Made it up top under the plateau. really pretty tree up there. Kind of cool. I mean, look at this. This is insane. Crazy. All right, so far this is my favorite view. There's a nice green meadow kind of in the middle here. Seth's not sure what his favorite view is. We're six, a little over six miles in, got about a mile and a half to go. And then we're gonna set, set up camp. Uh, woo. All right, it is eight o'clock. We made it to our campsite and you know, every backpacking trip has its hiccups. We didn't bring any silverware. So we whipped out our knives and we fashioned our own spoons. So uh, Seth's got his bag of camp. Um, this is a little water hole. It looks pretty disgusting, but it's actually pretty clean. So we're gonna boil some water, wash our feet. Uh, I'm gonna probably get in, but not underneath my head. Seth, what, you have anything to report after the first day? What are your thoughts? Thought I was gonna die at one point. We made really good progress and it's been a good trip. Good first day. So hopefully hopefully the spoons will do the job for our meals. This is the a cool rock that we're camping by. See that up there? That's pretty neat. So gonna get a gonna get the feet wet and we'll maybe do one more update before we go to bed. Yeah. All right, good morning, seven o'clock. You can see our tent right back there in the orange. Uh, slept pretty good, Seth slept pretty good. A little cold though, but it's warming up now. I don't think I'm gonna make any breakfast. I think I'm just gonna get a cliff bar might get going, but we'll keep you posted. It's a beautiful morning. All right, we're back on the move. We're climbing. 
pretty much vertically up. But then after this mile of up, we're done for up. But it's hard. Oh. All right, so we're here kind of at the canyon that we're gonna go into. So this whole, see if, I can't really see how low it gets. I can't, I'm not tall enough to. Anyways, we're hiking through this big canyon. We're gonna go into it. So this is the last time we're kind of up top. Then we go in. Hopefully there's water. All right, we made it into the canyon. You can hear the water. Seth uh, conquered his fear, walking some heights. How do you feel, Seth? Pretty good. Pretty good. It's a lot cooler down here. And this is the pretty much the remaining stretch of the hike is just walking in this big canyon. So, yeah. This is, this is the hike, walking through, walking through the valley. So cool. A big rock. All right, about to enter some narrows, it looks like. All right, we're here at the Narrows. I uh, made a really poor decision to put my shoes on and then took them off like 10 minutes later. Now they're just soaked and I never really used them. So should've gone barefoot the whole way. Not for next time. Look at that though, holy cow. This is awesome. All right, Seth is taking the backpacks. We gotta uh, swim through this pool and then we're gonna lower the backpacks on the other side. So Seth is on backpack duty. I'm gonna swim down and grab them. All right, we're approaching another narrow. Take two. <sighs> right, we're in another narrows. There's no one else here except for us. This whole time it's for one trail runner. Look how Look how beautiful this is. Just get to walk on barefoot. All right, we made it to camp and now we are enjoying our dinners. I am having cheese enchilada ranchero, Seth. Chili mac and cheese. And oatmeal. Yeah. Reuse the bag, recycle. Um, we're camping by, there's a, so this is one river. This is the river we kind of have hiked in on. And then right down there is another river. So we're camping right where two rivers uh, collide. Escalante and whatever this is. I forget what this one's called though. Is this Death Hollow Creek? Maybe Death Hollow Creek. And, uh, yeah, it's like six o'clock and get camp by some water and in a canyon. So very sweet. Highly recommend. And the, I tell you what, this uh, this spoon has never, never worked better. All right, 7.30 a.m. We're strapping our boots on. Campsite's down. Uh, I'm so sore. Uh, this, this is my first three-day backpacking trip. I've only done two days and oh, thank goodness it's not a fourth day. Ankles beat, shoulders beat. My pinky toe has a blister coming, so you gotta be mindful of that. Seth, how do you feel? Uh, tired and sore, but 
we got one more beautiful hike today and it's gonna be a good day It is 10.45, or maybe a little bit earlier than that. I don't know what time it is. We're sitting down, taking a break. Seth's putting on a sunscreen. The first part of this trail was terrible. It was bushwhacking. We got lost a few times. But since then, it's been good. But it's slow and steady. I got to take lots of breaks. But we're about halfway through, so we're also moving fast. You got anything, Seth? No. All right. We're tired. All right, we just crossed the log. We're, we're back to where we started. Seth hurt his knee. I think my shoulders are gonna fall off themselves. We have like a mile left, but it's only noon. So we've been crushing. We're already at like 10 miles in five hours. Heck of a, heck of a stat. We'll send one more when we're at the car. But that's all we got. All right. 12.18 and we're done in Woo! in five hours we did 10 and a half miles record so total we would have done a little over 30 because we did eight the first day 12 and a half the second day and then 10 and a half today 30 it's a little over 30 mile backpacking trip everyone is healthy dead? yeah we're good yeah we are dead but we're healthy no injuries would highly recommend Great trip. Any last words? No. <laughs> oh, so this is my, I have backpacked for three years in a row around June 12th, June 13th. So shout out Evan Griffith, Grant Santi for my last two trips, Seth Pierce for number three. So hopefully number four will be the same date with somebody new. So thanks for watching and signing off.